Hey guys, welcome back to my kitchen of vegan iniquity. More pumpkin. This is a French pumpkin called Poti Marron. I may be pronouncing that incorrectly, but I just wanted you to see it. I used half of it in today's recipe, but it's so pretty. Look at how nice and orange it is. Here's what I turned it into, peanut and pumpkin stew. This is so good. I tasted it while it was cooking for seasoning and stuff, and um, it has roasted pumpkin, some of the roasted pumpkin you puree, and some you leave in chunks. It's got peanuts, it's got peanut butter, onions, garlic, cayenne pepper, ginger, paprika, and vegetable broth. Uh, here's a peanut right here. The peanuts are so good. <laughs> you get um, raw peanuts. Mm. It's so yummy. Anyway, If you can't get raw peanuts, you can use roasted ones, but you probably will have to adjust the amount of salt. But you take the garlic, the cubes of pumpkin, and the peanuts, and you roast them all together on a pan. If you do get raw peanuts and roast them yourself, roast them extra because you're going to be munching on them while you're making the recipe. I love peanuts. There's also hominy. I almost forgot the hominy. This is kind of a southern recipe. There's also spinach. That the green, the green stuff is spinach. Mmm. I love this. Mm. I got a piece of hominy in that mouthful. I love it. It's so good. Also, if you're going to use peanut butter, use the natural kind that you have to stir up when you bring it home and keep it in the fridge. Don't use sweetened peanut butter and don't use peanut butter that's got like vegetable shortening in it. Use 100% peanut butter. Doesn't matter. It's really chunky. This is actually Trader Joe's unsalted peanut butter. I find peanut butter is so rich it doesn't need salt. I love Trader Joe's unsalted peanut butter. I wish more companies would make unsalted peanut butter because you don't need it. Anyway, this recipe will be on my blog. Surprise, surprise. And I will link it in the description, an even bigger surprise. <laughs> I'm, I'm so hungry, I'm giddy. So I'm being stupid. Anyway, thanks for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing. Try this stew. It's really good. I wish somebody would make one of my recipes. They're really good, I promise. Uh, regular uploads. Sunday, Tuesday, and Thursday. Regular community tab posts, Monday and Friday. Occasional shorts on Wednesday. Or occasional miscellaneous stuff on Wednesday that isn't short. Occasional cat videos on Catterday. We're going to break the rules, though, because it's um, Brownie's video anniversary is November 8th. So I will try to get a video up the same day as this. All about Brownie and his experiences over the last two years. He's such a good geety. Anyway.
anyway, uh, let me have another of my usual, um, spoonfuls for the road. This isn't too spicy, even though there's cayenne pepper in it, uh, you can control that. I wouldn't mind it if it was spicier. Mmm. Mmm. See you later, guys.